So what's your name? Tony Davis. I've been homeless for just over seven months now. I joined up in 1990 when I was 16. Uh, I'd always wanted to join the army, so... Um, I joined the 1st Battalion Devon and Dorset Regiment, so five years with them and two years in the 2nd Company Intelligence Corps. Five tours in Northern Ireland, um, former Yugoslavia, uh, I've been to the Falklands, uh, Canada, States, um, Kenya, British Honduras. Uh, Travelled all over the place, did, did quite a few tours over all over. So it was good. I, I would have stayed in for a long time, but I got medically discharged, so it took it out of my hands. The hardest bit was um, in there, everyone's got your, your, your bag, everyone helps each other and supports each other. Out here it's dog eat dog. Um, some people out here in, in civilian society will drag you down, not because you've done it, they do it just because they can. Um, well, I've got various um, fairly sheltered places I can sleep, um, stairwells, you know, uh, corridors, etc. But you just have to go around and, and find um, one where there aren't certain people there. You know, I, I don't like being near the alcoholics and the addicts. Um, obviously, you know, you can roll on a needle at night if the addicts are there. Um, the alcoholics are just completely hectic anyway. Um, and there's a lot of violence associated on the street, so I, I tend to find somewhere where I can and just keep out of the way. Um, it's, it's normally a fairly quick process doing that, but, but the main thing, I spend hours each day just, just trying to get a few, few coins together just to get enough to eat. It's a, it's a battle each day. Uh, well, you, generally you get moved on by, by the police or, you know, just through trouble breaking out on the street each day. And it's, it's very weather, weather, uh, very weather orientated as well. Um, obviously, if it's windy, rainy, whatever, you just, you know, have to shelter as best you can, move around accordingly. trying to survive hand to mouth. Um, ideally I'm trying to get enough to get in the night shelter over at Bournemouth but it, it proves very hard if not impossible most of the time to, to get that. It's either a choice between yeah. eating um, or going several days, a couple of days without food to get enough to get in the night shelter. So it's a catch-22 situation. Yeah, the, the problem I've got is chest infection so I've never ever shifted it. I've had it for about six weeks now. Um, I saw the hospital consultant this morning, um, I've been seeing him on a regular basis, but he says I've just got to get in the warm and dry as quickly as possible because I'm in real danger of getting pneumonia now. So.